Now, former President Uhuru Kenyatta's Jubilee Party has made changes to its National Executive Committee following the appointment of the eight officials to the government positions. In a statement released on Tuesday, Jubilee Secretary General Jeremiah Kioni explained that the move is in accordance to the Section 23 of the Leadership and Integrity Act 2012 and Section 12 of the Political Parties Act 2011. He said this in the court. In light of of those appointments, a National Executive Committee meeting held on November 7, 2023, made the necessary changes to allow the party to continue functioning effectively. The changes include these under court. Beatrice Gambo replacing Naomi Shaban as deputy party leader. Shaban was appointed as the chairperson of the Tobacco Control Board on October 12, 2023. Two, Joseph Menger replacing Peter Ole Mositit as deputy party leader. Mositit was appointed to chair the Nairobi Metropolitan Area Transport Authority on August 7. Number three, Kados Muiruri replacing Jimmy Angwenyi as deputy party leader. Angwenyi was appointed chairperson of the National Heroes Council on October 12. Number four, Saitoti Torome replacing Nelson Zuya as national chairperson. Zuya was appointed as a member of the Non Governmental Organization Corporation Board on October 12. Number five, Nderitu Muridi, replacing Joel Kibe as Business Council National Chairperson. Kibe was appointed as a member of the Council of the University of Nairobi on October 9. Number six, Pauline Jorogi, replacing Mutava Musimi as Deputy National Organizing Secretary. Musimi was appointed to chair the Presidential Task Force on Churches on May 4. And number seven, Maison Leshomo, replacing Fatuma Giri as Women League National Chairperson. Giri was appointed as a member of the Commission for Revenue Allocation on December 16, 2022. And at number eight, Yasir Noor, replacing Joshua Kutuni as Deputy Secretary General. Kutuni was appointed to chair the Kenya Copyright Board on October 27, 2023. Kioni confirmed that the appointments have been communicated to the Office of the Registrar of Political Parties for Record Keeping Purposes. This is in Cuba News.